everything's on that that's church the church is on fire. wait do you think this is happening the same time outlast is happening the, remember they set the church on fire at the end the priest uh, set the church on fire probably boom this is happening at the same fucking time no, I thought that well you sent out that message and they got some stuff or maybe he came while all this was happening. This is. Let's just say. Oh, wait, look back. Look back in there. He even took his damn pants. Tell you one thing. I've seen. Dude, that's, that's the scissors. The that's Edward Scissorhands. Man, let's wrap this up and get back to the truck. Shit! I knew. Yeah. This is. This was during. It was a little bit before and during. Oh, that's why you don't see that bat. Watch out for those guys. They got guns. Yeah. Fuck oh, you, right? You can Yeah, that's why you didn't see the big guy, but one time. You didn't see the dick dudes either. And they was both outside when you seen them. So you guys might have been really close to each other. Probably. Like when those people was running away, they might have seen him. Shit, man, this is awesome. Am I? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <sighs> Alright, so at this point in time, the big guy's probably dying right now. Go through that. Documents. More documents. I just want. I just want to get out of here. There it is. There's the uh. elevator. It probably was. Uh. Yeah, because remember you had to go up the stairs and shit. Uh. All right, it's all tied together. There's the the main room. Mr. Park. Mr. Park. <laughs> How the fuck are you still alive? Oh, oh fuck you! We was too close. No one. Oh fuck, Eddie. Fuck this. <laughs> yes! Get out of here. Woo! Yes! Finally, the outside. <laughs> There's his Jeep. Yep. Get in that fucking Jeep and drive away. There's nothing in the back seat. <laughs> Fuck.
There's him. Yeah. The Press that button. It's no going back, Mr. Park. There's enough hard evidence in that video file to make a world of shit for our friends at Murkoff. You got out of Mount Massive alive, and we've done everything in our power to cover your tracks. But our enemies are twitching and malicious corporate paranoiacs with resources you're too moral to imagine. You won't be the only target. Anyone you care about, your wife, your child, they'll be nothing to Murkoff but ways to hurt you. I need you to understand the bridge you're crossing here. You will do irrevocable damage to the company. You might even get close to something like justice. But once you click upload, your life is over. Everyone you love is fucked. But it's the right thing to do. Is hurting Murkoff worth that much to you? No. What do you say? Well, uh, we, have we, got to. To. we have to. Or we could just quit the game. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> that was it. And there Woo! is whistleblower. All right, guys. A uh, big thanks Woo! to everybody at Red Barrel Games for making this amazing game and this amazing dlc i've had a blast it's been a lot of scares a lot of fun too yeah surprises i mean a lot of surprises. It, yeah i mean it wasn't a true prequel it was a little bit before and then during the light yeah know, the first yeah there's there was so much more going on there than i thought i thought it was just going to be a prequel and it was going to end right when the game actually started but as you've seen it fucking it went yeah. beyond that shit. It was awesome. Really, really amazing. I'm glad we took the time to play it through. Yeah. All right. Uh, I would just like to say thank you guys for watching this epic journey of whistleblower. Um, we've had a blast. Yeah. You know, I'm Cody from Some Guys Gaming. This is Corey. This is Kevin. And. We'd all like you guys to hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the comments. Let Tell us what you guys think about Whistleblower and about Outlast in general. Make sure to check out our other videos. And that's it. Again, thanks for joining us on this Some Guys Play. And we will see you guys on the next one.